Put your manners back in. Do you think I was out of line? Yes, absolutely. Well, I apologize for that. Online, a lot of people think that Tom Cruise is an ISTP personality type. And I think it's because, you know, he's always wanting to do his own stunts. He's always jumping into these crazy, risky experiences. That level of being an adrenaline junkie, that must be an extroverted sensor, right? Me personally, I actually had no idea. I hadn't actually looked that much into Tom Cruise. This all changed though. Last summer, Mission Impossible came out and I I started seeing all these clips of how Tom liked interacting with people, what he liked talking about, how he liked sharing his ideas. I was like, wait a second, that doesn't sound like F.E. inferior. I'm not really seeing any ISTP personality patterns. Those actually seem a lot like some other personality patterns. Anyways, I ended up talking with Z about this and for a patron video, we did a whole bunch of research investigating this more for ourselves. Hope you guys enjoy this short snippet from what ended up happening next in control of everything and everyone he encounters in control of everyone and but today look at him look at Effie. control will be tested you know there's people out there that want help and that need help Wow. Would you also agree that Tom, people, there's a perception people, people. There, yeah. In that clip, did you see Tom Cruise very naturally reaching out to interact, harmonize outside? Also, the focusing a lot on people outside, being known for being in control of people and things outside. Those seem like a lot of extroverted preferences. Do you feel discriminated against when people say this is what Scientology is, that you're a bunch on a lunatic fringe or whatever? Does that... Peter? Tom? No one's ever said that to me. But no, I mean that perception out there. Yeah, but that's not the perception out there. Mm. I, I, that is absolutely, uh, maybe from your perspective. This isn't my personal opinion. Oh. I'm just saying, well, not, really. Not, not even your own faith. I, I find that appalling when, when people who don't know what they're talking mm. about say things like that. Mm. I think it's, uh, I think it's appalling. I think it's appalling uh, that they're still burning synagogues in France. I think it's appalling how certain Muslims are being treated. I think it's absolutely appalling when we talk about freedom of speech and human rights. I think it's appalling that they electric shock people. Oh, it's so intense. I think it's appalling that they drug children. I think it's appalling that they say that there are no solutions for those things. Whoa. I think it's appalling Look at that him people totally. have to live a life of, of drug addiction. Wow. Okay, when I have personally personally help people get off drugs. It's wow. obvious Tom Cruise is a passionate man. Yes, he is. A passionate man. <laughs> Ooh. When he's getting super intense there, did you see how he didn't jump to talk about things in a very concrete, realistic way? Instead, he jumped to talk about a pattern his perspective on this is how i think things are sort of connected and tied together this is what i think is actually going on a guess intuition under the surface ISTPs do have an intuitive side a side of them that does sometimes speculate a little bit but it usually looks very different from what Tom Cruise just did there. ISTPs, because their extroverted sensing is higher, the information that they like to explore and focus on first, it's usually concrete sensory data, stuff that's like very connected to what they're seeing in front of them, stuff that they can verify with real life experience. And then from there, yes, they do like speculating and guessing about things sometimes. Hmm, I have this feeling things might be going in this direction, but again, their guesses about things, they're usually still tied to something pretty concrete, something that they're seeing in real life. In contrast, did you see how with Tom Cruise, he wasn't focusing on being concrete. Instead, he was very focused on the pattern, the connection, the bigger picture perspective that he really wanted the other person to see. That's a clue. Tom Cruise might have an intuitive function a little bit higher. Why don't we, why don't, listen, Here's the, th here's the thing, Peter. Yeah. You're stepping over a line now. You're stepping over a line. You know you are. I suppose the questions Peter, that people want to know. Peter, you want to know. <laughs> Take responsibility for what you want to know. Don't say what other people. This is a conversation that I'm having with you right now. You're right. Okay. So I'm just telling you right now. Okay. Ooh. Just put your manners back in. Do you think I was out of line? Yes, 
Absolutely. Well, I apologize for that okay. sincerely. Do you see how naturally and confidently Tom is managing the interaction outside, the outside people dynamic? He has a strong idea of how you're supposed to say things, how the dynamic should be. He has some group feelings, values that he wants to enforce to fix or correct things outside. I don't mind answering questions, but there's a way of phrasing something that is that's polite oh, and has manners and things that I say, you know what? I wouldn't answer that to, to someone coming up to me at a party. Yeah. But when I read so much about you, Tom, they, these are questions you answer. Peter, you want to waste your time on this one? Oh, or do you want to ask some other questions? 20 years yeah, time. Yeah, we'll talk years. You want to move on? <laughs> Peter, come on, let's go, man. Did you see that? Oh, He's like, come on, fix it. Get back on track. ISTPs, because their introverted thinking is higher, they really value thinking for themselves as individuals. And in turn, that makes it so they're usually like, hey, let's just let everyone just sort of think for themselves and do what makes sense to them. ISTPs, they do care about people, but you usually don't see them inserting themselves to manage the social dynamic outside the way that Tom Cruise just did. Actually, with ISTPs, because their extroverted feeling is inferior, they're actually usually personality types that tend to overthink. How do I fit in with other people or take care of everyone else's feelings when sometimes their feelings or expectations don't fully make sense to me? I wanna know people. I wanna understand what life is about, Peter. And, uh, and I really, uh, I wanna help people. Oh wow. It's not Bro, he say. is such a, I was right. Thank you. Peter, thanks man. What I call an interesting interview. Thank oh you. wow. Did you see he fixes it at the end? He's like, still fixes the connection. Hey. Thank you. <laughs> good. <laughs> Cause with FE, there's this expectation that the connection is still, you gotta still be responsible for your part mm -hmm. in, in it. And mm -hmm. so even though in his head, maybe his TI part is like, yeah. I don't like this guy. But it's still like, there's still a responsibility to be like a conscious person. Thank you. Peter, thanks, man. What I call an interesting interview. Thanks, man. <laughs> it was terrific. <laughs> That's so <laughs> epic. It was terrific. Oh, it was terrific. God. That's, oh my God. So epic. Yeah. Like, when yeah. Effie does that, they're always giving you feedback. Like, I'm having a great time, by the way. Yeah. Uh, yeah. This is a really great and interview. He's just still doing the performing. Even, when, even after you told me to learn some minutes. <laughs> That's all right. You stepped out of line. I whacked you. We got it. We got it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, okay. Holy crap. Like, that was so good. So, F.E., when the social harmony is being disrupted and someone is being inappropriate or steps out of line, to what Tom Cruise said, he said it perfectly. Hey, that's okay. I just had to give you a little bit of a slap on the wrist. I had to step and in to enforce or remind you of the social context and the rules and the expectations. And then you corrected yourself and then we're all good. Yeah. And sometimes I have to step in and emotionally manage that. So it's not like Effie's always happily Im managing things. Sometimes they have to manage through a different emotion. And if that emotion is more terse or stern or maybe showing a bit more of a serious angry face, to get everybody to come back together. Yeah, sure, because it's extroverted feeling. If you guys want to see the full version of our video on Tom Cruise's personality type, that video is one of my favorite videos on the membership site, linked down below in the description. If you guys enjoyed today's video, I think you'll really enjoy that one. And becoming a member, it's one of the best ways to support the channel. Thank you guys so much for watching today. We'll see you guys in the next ones. Peace, peace, bye. And I would, I would lay there and, and just dream about stories. Mm. You know, I was always that kid. Oh, wow. I was also the kid that, you know, we traveled around a lot, but I would, I would open my window.